Giant sea turtles nesting on a beach and floating gracefully through coral reefs are among the most inspiring visions in nature. Across the world, people are banding together to protect sea turtles and improve their communities by offering opportunities for travelers to participate in conservation efforts. Sea Turtles is a new conservation project working with communities and tour operators to connect people with unique conservation programs. To kick off this project, we took a group of travelers on a tour of Costa Rica in 2008 put together by our friends at EcoTeach, who are donating all profits to conservation. Our itinerary included visits to key turtle beaches, hiking the rainforest, boat rides along rivers, coasts, and canals, and a surprise or two. Our first stop was Parismina along the North Caribbean coast. Since the town was founded, its residents have depended on the trade of sea turtles and their eggs, with nearly every egg taken from the beach. In 2001, a small group of people decided it was time to change the town's relationship with these ancient creatures. Calling themselves Save the Turtles of Parismina, this group has built a program that brings travelers and volunteers to help protect turtles. Former poachers now lead patrols. Poaching has dropped drastically, and the town now benefits from conservation tourism. The next day, we headed to the South Caribbean. A small group of us went out to look for leatherbacks again that night at Kawita National Park. These adventurous souls were rewarded with the opportunity to help study a huge leatherback. The next day, we helped Widecast Latin America, a local conservation group, organize a community workshop inviting residents to learn how conservation efforts can benefit the local economy. To our surprise, Widecast brought turtles with them. These turtles were released back to the ocean after being confiscated from poachers. Locals and tourists watched these tough little turtles make their way to the ocean. That evening we visited Gondoka, the southernmost beach in Costa Rica. We first visited the Widecast hatchery, where turtle eggs are protected until they hatch. There we learned about a program turning plastic bags into beautiful handbags, recycling waste while bringing income to local communities and conservation efforts. Turtles aren't the only reptiles being protected here. We also visited an iguana conservation project run by the Bree Bree tribe in the Kekalde Indigenous Reserve. Saying goodbye to the turtles, we then headed inland to Puerto Viejo de Serapiqui. We packed our last full day with adventure, first zip lining in the morning, then we planted trees to reduce our carbon footprint and cooled off rafting in the Sarapiqui River. Back in San Jose, we shared our thoughts of what we had learned and exchanged journey bags for good luck on future travels. In one week we saw eight turtles, met many dedicated conservationists, and raised $5,000 for Save the Turtles of Parismina and Widecast Latin America. Will you join our next trip? The turtles are waiting.